Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. In today's video we are having one very interesting question from radical equations. Equation is 4th root of 68 minus x square plus square root of x equal to 3 times 4th root of 4. We have to find out all real solutions. So let's get started. I will begin with division by 4th root of 4. This side also. Now we can cancel 4th root of 4 from RHS, numerator and denominator. So it will be 4th root of 68 minus x square divided by 4th root of 4 plus square root x divided by 4th root of 4 equal to 3. Now I will write 4th root of 4. It can be written as 4 power 1 over 4. Now base 4 can be written as 2 square. Whole power is 1 over 4. Using property of exponent a power b whole power c. Any time we can take product in the parts. So this will be written as 2 power 2 times 1 by 4. Now this will be 1 and here we can write 2. So it is 2 power 1 over 2 which is square root of 2. So we can replace 4th root of 4 by square root of 2 here in the denominator. Let's replace and I will club 4th root 68 minus x square divided by 4 using property of radicals plus this is square root x over square root 2 and right hand side is 3. Now I will club the second term numerator and denominator. So I can write 68 minus x square over 4 in 4th root. 68 minus x square over 4 in 4th root plus square root of x by 2 equal to 3 and I have used here property nth root of a divided by nth root of b. It can be written as nth root of a by b. Now, I will consider the division of 4. Let me write here 4th root of 68 over 4 minus x square over 4. plus square root x by 2 equal to 3 or I can write 4th root of this is 17 minus x square over 4 plus square root x by 2 equal to 3. Now I will use substitution x by 2 is there its square is written over there, x square by 4. So let us consider x by 2 equal to a. So this equation will become 4th root of 17 minus a square plus square root of a equal to 3. Let us write 4th root of 17 minus a square plus square root of a equal to 3. Now we will consider another substitution. This radicant I will consider b square. So let us write 17 minus a square equal to b square. See what will come out. 
it will become fourth root of i will write b square plus the square root of a equal to 3 now fourth root and power 2 it will left with only square root b plus square root a equal to 3 and from substitution equation i can write a square plus b square equal to 17. So I will consider this is my first equation and suppose this is my second equation. Now we have to solve the system. Let me write here. So I will be writing equation number 1 square root a plus square root b equal to 3 and second equation which I will be writing here a square plus b square equal to 17. Now I will consider first equation and let us take a squaring of that. So I will be writing a square root a plus a square root b whole square equal to 3 whole square. a plus b whole square. So root a whole square a root b whole square b plus 2 times a square root a times a square root b. So I can write a square root a b equal to 9. Let's consider the square root a b equal to t. So I can write from here a plus b plus 2 t equal to 9 or a plus b equal to 9 minus 2 t. I will consider squaring once again as we have a square plus b square as equation number 2. So let me write here power 2 and let me write here power 2. So this will become a square plus b square plus twice ab. If root ab is t then ab will be t square. So I will write twice ab equal to 9 minus 2t whole square. Now in place of ab I will write t square. So a square plus b square. This value I can write 17. So this is 17 as per equation 2 plus 2t square equal to 9 minus 2t whole square. Now this is quadratic equation in t. So let's solve this quadratic equation first. 17 plus 2t square is equal to 9 minus 2t whole square. Let's write a minus b whole square formula. So this will become 17 plus 2t square and 9 minus 2t whole square. 81 plus 4t square minus 36t. Take all the term to one side. 2t square minus 36t plus 64 equal to 0. Equation is divisible by 2. So I will write t square minus 18t plus 32 equal to 0. So I can use factorization method. I will be writing splitting minus 18 as minus 16 minus 2. We will get factors t minus 2 times t minus 16 equal to 0. So from here we will be having two values of t, 2 and 16. Now substitution, t was our substitution, this was ab. So I will write it was root ab equal to t. This was our original substitution. So I will write here t square will be 4 and 16 square is 256. Now this is our ab. ab equal to t square. So I will write here ab equal to 4 and ab equal to 256. Now I will use our first equation. It was 
root a plus root b. So I will be writing here. Here it is. So a plus b was 9 minus 2t. And our t values are 2 and 16. So I can write directly from there a plus b value. It would be 9 minus 2t. So 9 minus 2 times 2 first value and 9 minus 2 times 16 second value. So this is 9 minus 4 5 and second value will give us 9 minus 32 which is negative 23. Now equations are easier a plus b 5 and minus 23 where a b is 4 and 256. Let us frame two quadratic equation two system first. So I will write here a plus b equal to 5 and a b equal to 4. This is first system and a plus b equal to negative 23 where a b equal to 256. Let's frame two quadratic equation quickly. So I will write here a square minus sum of roots, sum of roots, product of roots minus 5a plus 4 equal to 0. Here I will frame a square plus 23a plus 256 equal to 0. So from second equation if we will calculate discriminant then it is 23 square which is 529 minus 2 times 256 4ac. 4 times 256, 1024. So this value will be negative 495. Complex solutions we will reject. Now come to the first quadratic. I can easily factorize it by splitting our middle term. a minus 1 times a minus 4 equal to 0. So a equal to 1 and a equal to 4. Now we have to write the value of x. So our substitution was x by 2 equal to a. So I will write x by 2 equal to 1 and 4. So x is equal to multiply by 2, 2 and 8. So these are our real solutions. If we want to cross examine, we can check also. So let us write check x is equal to 2. So I will be writing LHS. 4th root of 68 minus 2 square. So 64. Plus a square root of 2. Let's check whether it is coming out 3 times 4th root of 4. So I can split 4th root and 64 times 4. Plus a square root 2. We can write is 4th root 4. Okay, now 4th root of 16, which will be 2, and 4th root of 4 plus 4th root of 4. Now 4th root of 16 is 2 times 4th root of 4 plus 4th root of 4. So this value is. 3 times 4th root of 4. Similarly, we can cross examine with 8 also, and this is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching, friends. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe. Bye bye till next video. Good luck. Take care of yourself. Bye bye.